Hello, Macy here. This is VTOL Isprit Mark 5. Not much different from the Mark 4, just a few balance changes and a few tweaks here and there. But there's one thing I've been trying to do for a long time in all the versions of this game. And guys, 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 I finally managed to do it. I have weapons on this. There's a couple of loadout options I'm working with, so this is just a test to see how they go. Firstly, these are my missiles. Long range, high power, very accurate. And that's the sort of range we have. So, not bad at all really, I was quite impressed with those. Um, I've always claimed Isprit was a fighter, but how can she really be a fighter without any weapons? So, I think I'm solving this, but I need to test fly this and make sure it's not damaging how she flies too much. They are quite heavy, these self-propelled missiles, but they have very little kickback, so I can fire them from a VTOL position, which means I can be very accurate with where I want to deliver the payload. I mean, in this view, I can use that little reticule in the middle there to line it up, and you can see them going pretty straight. Bullseye. So I think I can have a little f bit of fun with this ship. I could probably design a mission where I could maybe you know take something out and return that'd be great but like I said they are quite heavy so I experimented with another type of armament this being a projectile so it's not self propelled but it does therefore have a lot of kickback when I fire it so I need to be moving but this is quite good here you go, so high explosive impact, but that's a solid round, I've just propelled it, propelled it forward using a separatron, basically. But, because this is much lighter, it's affecting the flight performance a lot less, so I just want to see if I can actually fly from the cockpit and still be able to get around on target, because from the brief experimentation I've been doing, it's very hard to actually aim it from an outside view, so from here I can just aim up much easier using that reticule tinted area in the middle there. Um, so I'm just trying to get some altitude here and wheel round and try and get an attack run on this control tower and see how effective this is actually going to be. It still flies okay because this is much lighter, it's not too bad, it's a little bit twitchy but it's still flying. So aim this up and that's a hit, confirmed hit. So it does work. It does work. I'm surprised, but it does work. It's just really a, an explosive stack separator and a couple of separatron jets. That's all it really is. The missiles are a little bit more complicated. But these are really good because although slightly cruder, they are much lighter. So one more go. <laughs> I thought I'd put six of them on there because it seems a bit... Um, tight to have only one shot. I mean, you've only got one go at it then, so it'd be nice to have a couple of shots. So, this is really at the limit of what this ship can actually carry, and it's taken a lot of fuel to even get me up, so it's not massively practical. But this is pretty good. Fully armed for war, gunship. We've got six shots on this now, so let's give it a quick test. Let's fire the first two. There you go, and light up the second. That works surprisingly well, and that's quite a lot of fun. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, um, I'm going to try and land it, because the problem with these cannons over the missiles is that it does leave a lot of dead weight on the ship, the empty separaton, separatron um, cases. So I just want to see if it can still fly and land. It's a bit twitchy. It's not nearly as nice to fly as it was in the last testing video you saw. But it's still flying. It's still up there despite the extra weight. I apologise for being deliberately ambiguous about how I'm actually making these rockets and missiles. I just want to keep my hand a little bit close to my chest just until I finish the testing phase because they're not really complete yet but I will show you exactly how I've made these. It would be nice to hear what you think, actually. Do you think that this is working? Do you think that's actually a weapon? Is there potential in this? Or is it just 
<laughs> a bit silly, I'm not sure. It's a lot of fun either way, but um, I'm just trying to land this, as I said before. I'm taking it much slower than I was in my last video and just easing it down. The edge of the runway was creeping up on me a bit there. I had to put it down. So, that was Isprit Mark V, along with her various new loadout options. Um, hope you enjoyed. Bye for now.